This is CNN Breaking News. All right, we have new video coming in of a terror attack in Tel Aviv in Israel. It happened on a bus in the middle of the city. Um, a Palestinian man, according to authorities, went on board that bus and began stabbing people. He then ran off the bus and stabbed some other people. Let's head to Jerusalem now and check in with Elise Labatt. Um, I just want to warn our viewers before we show them this video, it's, it's disturbing. Well, that's right, Carol. This 23-year-old Palestinian uh, gentleman from the West Bank city of Tel Kurum, a couple of stations from the main uh, bus station in Tel Aviv, central Tel Aviv, Carol, during the start of rush hour, women, children, soldier on, the, on this uh, bus, basically stabbed about eight people. Then you can see in the video, the man gets off the bus, runs, is look, kind of running around, sees another person, stabs them, and then tries to make his getaway. Now, Carol, at this point, he was discovered uh, by some people that worked for the Israeli prison authority. They saw the bus was stopped at a green light of people running off the bus. They went in pursuit of this Palestinian man. They shot him in the leg. They arrested him, interrogated him, and, and obviously uh, searched the area to see if there were any more suspects. There are not. Um, right now, he's in custody. And uh, Tel Aviv on high alert, as is Jerusalem, Carol. Was this the, you know, what they call a lone wolf attack, or is it something more? It does seem as it's a lone wolf attack. And this is really, Carol, what we've seen um, as the new tactic in Israel. You remember last year there were a lot of instances of Palestinians mowing down Israelis with their cars, particularly in Jerusalem. We had that horrible uh, stabbing in a Jerusalem synagogue. These seem to be lone wolf attacks not necessarily a t a connected with any terrorist group, but certainly um, share their aspirations. And today, Hamas did praise that attack. There's no indication that Hamas is involved in any way. And Hamas did praise the attack, so saying that the Israelis deserve this for their treatment of Palestinians. And for his part, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu said this is the kind of incitement against Israel, against Jews, anti-Semitism that we saw in Paris and elsewhere around the world that inspires people um, to take these attacks, Carol. All right. Um, I would like us to stop showing that video because it is disturbing because you see a woman on the street being stabbed. So we're going to stop showing that now. You're going to try to gather more information for us, Elise. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Let's talk about